Welcome back. This is Jack, and this is Dead Space 2. In my last recording, I finished up playing StarCraft, so I wanted to have a space filler until my next one of One Piece Pirate Warriors 4, and I figured Dead Space 2 would be a good one to run with. I'm still going to beat Dead Space 1 for you guys, but I wanted to go ahead and get this one going because this one is terrifying. Like, this was the, actually the first one I played. And I'm not, I'm not going to lie, I'm also trying to test out a new setup I'm kind of doing. Uh, you, it, you won't notice anything on your end until a couple points. You might notice a couple points, but that's beyond what I needed to tell you guys. Let's get this going. Um, it is not letting me click. There it goes. Uh, we're just going to do normal. I'm not going to do too difficult. I'm actually tempted for casual just because I'm trying to... Oh, spoilers for the other game. Nicole Brennan's dead. You find out the whole time you thought she was alive and talking to you, she's actually dead. Isaac Clarke's girlfriend. So he's going, the, um, the marker was making him go crazy. Isaac, are you there? Her. Come in, Isaac. Oh, God. I'm so sorry, Isaac. Look at the time difference. No, 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 I'll call you back okay. later. It's okay. <clears throat> How you doing? Good. You're right, Isaac. The Ishmer is a great ship. I am so lucky to be serving aboard her. Enjoy it while it lasts. You know they're going to decommission her next year. Isaac. Thank you. For what? For just pushing me to do this. I mean, if it weren't for you, I never would have made it this far, because you made me stick with it. I'll just remember, I'm giving you up for six months so you can do this. You know what? We must be getting out of range there, Isaac. Isaac, can you hear me? Look, I'm going to call you back as soon as I can, okay? Isaac. Isaac! You were drifting away for a moment there, Mr. Clark. I believe you were telling me about your nightmares that you've been having. About your dead girlfriend. What was her name? Nicole. I didn't want it to end like this. I really wanted to see you again. This game, this Just once, once ups the mind I loved effing you. factor. I always loved you. Yes. Nicole Brennan. She was a senior medical officer stationed aboard a Planet Cracker class vessel. Ishimura. USG Ishimura, yes. Part of a mining operation on Aegis 7. I understand communications went down shortly after their arrival. You were part of the repair mission. A mission for which you volunteered, am I right? What did you find aboard that ship, Isaac? They found something. What did they find aboard the ship, Isaac? The marker. Did you have contact with this marker? It made you see things, didn't it? Things you didn't want to see. It spoke to me. What did it say, Isaac? What did it say to you, Isaac? Isaac! Isaac, can you hear me? This game just gets more and more mm, as it goes, trust me. It just... Isaac. Oof. Isaac, can you hear me? Dead Space 3 let the ball drop a bit. <sighs> But they still mess with your mind quite Dana, a bit, especially in multiplayer. I found Isaac Clark. Repeat, I have him. Great work, Franco. Be careful. He's been out a long time. Oh, yeah. Okay. Good, good. Steady, steady, steady. So I'm currently basically in a straight jacket right straight now. Jacket. My health's not even full. Where, where am I? All right, I, I know you're confused right now. I can explain everything, but you gotta trust me, okay? Listen. You're in terrible, terrible danger. That much danger. Just that much danger. Could you imagine this with modern graphics? Like PS whatever. By the way, this is not a cinematic anymore. I am now playing. Still straight jacket. Am I running too? As Mad Techie pointed out, the first thing this game teaches you is how to run. That should be a... Yep, that was the wrong way. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Nope, not dead yet. Almost dead. Not dead yet. Yep, they got me. 
that fast. Um, but as Matt Tacky pointed out, he said, the first thing they teach you how to do in this game is to run. That should be a testament of, like, what this game's gonna be like. Uh, straight jacket, surrounded by monsters, who are just dropping in for a dear old time. Oh, I can press E a lot. He has been disarmed! Oh, now look at me. I'm so close to dead. Like, if I fart the wrong way, I might die. But thankfully, I'm in a save station, so... Because I don't have to do that running sequence again. <sighs> Got the blood flowing there, doesn't it? They were about to shoot. They didn't care. They said, Clark, take him down. This is Director Tyson to They're all looking for personnel. I want the key subjects terminated and the facility scrubbed. This is not a drill. Tyson out. <laughs> I have this image in my head of a giant space laser, and it's just listed as not a drill. Alright, if I had the ability to actually do anything, now would be a great time to just, like, smash things and find loot. My eye's looking much better today, yes, don't you think? It hurts. It still hurts. Yes, I'll schedule another you for survival. another session tomorrow. Oh, yeah, shit. Oh, no. No, no, I, I don't think I'm ready. I, I don't think I can take another session out. There. First thing tomorrow. Now let's talk about what you saw today. Come on, Strauss. I'm here to help you. It was black. Deep black and glowing red with symbols. Symbols whispered to me. And what did the symbols whisper to you? Come on, Strauss. What? It was just sharp. It was just sharp, but I put so much stuff in my head, so much shit in my head. There's no more room for anything. Is that a dirty word? I can't remember what he looks like, but I can't remember. Right, the symbols, Strauss. What did the symbols tell you? Because my new set, I'm not even sure I'm recording right now, but I'm going to pretend like I am in case I am. Oh, that looks fun. Oh! I've got a knife in my throat now. Come on, man. Station 4. I remember you. Tideman <laughs> said we... All the key subjects need to be eliminated. Listen. Terminated. <laughs> Which one more? Listen to me, man. What matters? Listen to what me! What matter? We can both get out of here. <laughs> just... Just cut me out of this straight jacket. No one's getting out of here alive. There's no escaping from what I've done. <laughs> take it easy, buddy. Just take it easy. The rig is red. It's red. It's a health pack and a flashlight in that wall locker. You should grab them. Go ahead. Take it. Just how ominous him I just won't saying. Be needing it anymore. Your rig is red. I've got a flashlight now, so I can Isaac, see it. Isaac, we're all gonna burn for what we did to you. I'm the one trying to rescue you. Why? What's going on? You're suffering from a unique form of dementia, Isaac. Something you contracted on age seven. How do you know that? How do you know all this about me? Your dementia will kill you. 
But if you can get here, I can treat you and get you to safety. Why should I trust you? Because I'm not the one shooting at you. Fuck. Just follow the route I'm sending you. Still be okay. That that you just <laughs> that was just a wheelchair going past it. Ooh, chess. Can we play chess? Oh, and there's blood on the pieces. I'll I'll I'll, I'll wait until they've been cleaned up. Wait, hang on. See? No, oh, okay. So, a bit of lore. Um. I hate jump scares. Especially when I can't do anything about them. So... Is that unlocked? It's not unlocked. Oop. It is an audio log. Orderly TPS report 1418. The recent realization that the popsicle sticks were being constructed into marker-like miniatures for over a year has led to a search of the unit for any other such phenomena. It appears widespread, with mar Sorry, I just wanted to get a quick save in. Forms being made out of medication bottles, hypodermic needles, and even toiletry items like nail clippers and tweezers. The research teams have all been notified of the discovery. So basically, the uh, marker has two ways of interacting with a person. If you are someone of lower intelligence or average intelligence, um, it just makes you go insane. Your brain just cannot process the information it is putting in you. If you're intelligent, like an engineer or a scientist, this is what it does to you. It makes you go and crazy. It makes you go crazy because you're able to process and understand what it's trying to tell you to do, and you are driven to try and make a marker. Now, some people are wondering how the hell is his access granted? He's an engineer for the company that knows these things. By default, I met him. By default, it would recognize him as an engineer and let him in. Um, and because of system bureaucracy, I imagine they wouldn't have taken him out even though he's been commissioned to pass it. Isaac, what happened? Are you alright? Why are you helping me? If Tideman finds you, more people will die. Including me. Not if you follow my route. I don't like this. You don't have to like it. Just hurry before you get locked in. Now I can grab and throw things. Like this. So if something were to show its face right now. I hear something there is. This is supposed to be a little tutorial spot because so they give me plenty of ammo. And it only takes one to pen it. So that's what you can do. I tried to do that a lot in Dead Space 1, but it didn't work out very well. Um, I don't know why. But that's what you can do. And don't get me wrong, my heart is beating. Even though I know what's going on, what's, I have an idea of what's about to happen, this game still terrifies me. My only regret is that it stopped at 3. I'd like them to do a remake. I'm like think, thinking of like... Could you imagine, like, Hita Kojima making Dead Space 4? Like, his dedication to making his artistic games. Yeah, throw a corpse. Throw it again. You can also do that. You can kill them and take one of their claws to throw. It's an easy way to save some ammo, uh, but it takes it takes practice to be able to snapshot them, and 
honestly, you have to be calm. If you're panicking, it's not going to work. Uh, so I, I don't pull it off very often because I get my adrenaline pumping and then I just... I don't black, uh, do... I don't hit black zone, which um, in, in security terms means you are still moving and functioning. You just don't process information correctly. You're just reacting. Responding, but definitely got the adrenaline pumping. Okay, now I know what part of that thing I've got to start Oh God, please do something! Oh God, please do something! Oh God, please, please help me! Calm down. I'll cut you out of there. Is that a tissue laser? A plasma cutter? Oh my god! Fuck. What the fuck are you oh, doing? Shit! Help! I'm trying! I'm trying! I'm trying! Just don't forget, first and foremost, Isaac Clark is an engineer. He's not some badass soldier. He's an engineer. close for me to really get a good hit on. Okay, now he's gotta be dead, but it's his friends over there that I'm worried about. Want that thing breaking free and coming after me in just a second. I don't know how much ammo I have. It looks like I have just enough. I have six more shots plus my own four reload. Isaac, it's Dana. You have to dismember the creatures to stop them. I know. I've had a lot of practice. Just try to stay in one piece. Thanks. Okay, still rotates at the space bar. Alright. So, I'm gonna use this save point as a stopping point. Um, I already have my heart just pumping, but I gotta keep these videos short. Because the Doom videos I'm gonna be releasing simultaneously will be my longer videos. These will be my shorter ones. And, um, yeah. It's, it gets me going. It gets my blood pumping. Uh, so let me go ahead and hit the save real fast, and this is one of my new setup things, so if you like my work, please like, subscribe, and share. I appreciate it, and it's the only way I can grow my channel. Thank you.